What's up YouTube, Demonks here today, and I want to talk about the 13 Secrets of Darkness within Kingdom Hearts 3. Now we know 6 out of the 13 of the Secrets of Darkness, so I'm going to go through the 6 real fast, and then I'm going to predict the, the rest of the 7, because, I mean, you guys pretty much heard of heard it all you know master Xehanort he's the mastermind young Xehanort's the the youngest out of the Xehanort's I believe and then you have answer of secret darkness I mean he's one of my favorites the main antagonist for Kingdom Hearts 1 then you have Xemnas the main antagonist for Kingdom Hearts 2 you got Zigbar you know he's been by Xemnas side the whole time Xehanort's side the whole time throughout ever since birth by sleep and you have Syax you know he was just taken unwillingly so he was knocked out but I, I guess he does does he have the will does he have will anymore does he have, does he have the will to resist does he know or does he want to be a part of I feel like he he's being mind controlled in some capacity knowing cuz I feel like if he if he knew like Zeno's true plan he wouldn't want to be a part of this but I think he's been mind controlled so now we're going to move on to speculation the 13 secrets of the darkness who do I think is going to be part of that team I mean it's possible it could be from anyone throughout the Kingdom Hearts series but let's start with the most obvious one I think is Vanitas coming back as part of the 13 Secrets of Darkness taking that spot from Sora you know and I feel like once Ventus wakes up in Kingdom Hearts 3 Ventus will also be reborn and Xehanort will find him somewhere in the realm of darkness pick him up use him as a vessel maybe carp be part of this be the last piece of 13 Secrets of Darkness so that's probably going to be I'm going to say midway through to uh, uh the Kingdom Hearts three because like I said they either either uh, either Xehanort's gonna have to fight either the 13 Secrets of Darkness or the Seven Guards of Light are gonna clash or Xehanort's gonna hunt down the Seven Princes of Light and I feel like he's gonna hunt down new Seven Princes of Light that's why I added those new uh, princess worlds within Kingdom Hearts 3 with my list of worlds I like to see in Kingdom Hearts 3 so he's either gonna go that down that road and I feel like Ventus is gonna wake up in the beginning of Kingdom Hearts 3 so he's probably gonna wake up in the middle of it or near the end, so we'll have to wait and see how that all turns out. And I feel like Venus would be an awesome can. He would mess with Sora's emotions, you know, and 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 Kyrie. It would be just fantastic to see Venus in action in Kingdom Hearts. I would love it, and especially him as a thirteenth vessel of the Thirteen Secrets of Darkness. And another character would be Terranort, which is basically Terra fused with uh, Xehanort during the time of you know Birth by Sleep, after the events of Birth by Sleep, where he kind of loses his memory. That'd be pretty cool. I mean, that can be a way to save Terra within Kingdom Hearts 3. I, I think that'd be pretty cool. You know, extract the the Xehanort part of t part of Terra out of him. That way, you bring him back to the side of the light, and you, you know he can help uh, with the final cl climactic battle within Kingdom Hearts 3. That'd be awesome. I would really like to see that happen. Uh, I I really I, I have high hopes that Terra Terranort is gonna be one of the 13 Secrets of Darkness because he is part of. Xehanort in that time period, so that'd be really cool. I'd like to see that happen. Next up is Marluxia. The reason I pick Marluxia is not just because he's one of my favorite organization members, but he is a really powerful character. You know, even though you know Sora still was able to take him out, you know he had two forms. But then again, he was like a final boss of a, a game, so of course the final boss is gonna have like two or multiple forms that capacity. But I, I think Xehanort has some entry. Like, wow, this guy's a really powerful character. Maybe I'll take him as one of my vessels. You know, that way, you know, I can, it, it could be a squad. <laughs> That's a squad right there. Malusha is badass. I like him. Uh, even though he's a bit, uh, he's a bit, uh, what's the word for him? He's a bit, uh, he's got, he's got that wave. He's got, he's got the flower petals that can, that can turn people off from him. He's got the pink hair rocking that. But he's got a scythe, dude. He's got a scythe. I would really love to see Malusha come back. Fighting game would be awesome in Kingdom Hearts 3. I don't know if they're going to actually, is it, they're going to get a girl in the roster, but who knows. And it's possible. And a Riku replica. A lot of people have been tossing this name around, possibly being one of the next vessels for, uh, for one, being one of the other vessels for the Thirsty Secrets of Darkness. I don't think that's gonna be the case, because, uh, because they, like I said, they only need one more spot to fill with the Thirteen Secrets of Darkness. So, and, and I feel like the rest of them might not be. I don't think. Uh, yeah, I don't think Riku replica is gonna make the cut. But if he does, that'd be pretty cool. Another face off between Riku and Riku replica. That'd be awesome, but I don't think it'd be necessary. I feel like he just—I don't think this is the way he—he because he, Riku Replica wants to be his own person. He doesn't want to be another Xehanort. He doesn't want to be someone else again. You know what I mean? So I don't think that his motives will want him to be part of that—that that team, that Thirteen Secrets of Darkness. But who knows? He might just be mind controlled again, like a puppet, like the puppet he is. So 
there's that. And then I'm going to leave three open spots for new characters that can be part of the 13 Secrets of Darkness. I'd like to see a, another female in there, maybe two. That'd be awesome. You know, have some more female characters within this group. It'd be kind of weird seeing women turn into Xehanort, right? Because you're, you're turning women into a man. So that'd be kind of weird. But I guess it's not going to be like that entirely. But who knows? So I'm leaving these th three open spots to new characters. Let me discuss in the comment section who you think is going to be part of the 13 Secrets of Darkness. Let me discuss in the comment section. Like, subscribe, more content to me on Kingdom Hearts 3 and other games in general. I'm Demolex. I'll see you in the future.